how to set up different prices for products variants on Shopify. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can set up the price for the product or a specific product and how we can change the variance price of that product. So the process is very easy. You're going to head over your admin dashboard of your Shopify store. And from here, when you have the access, you're going to head over the products. In here, you need to have at least one product that has some variants. So for example, I have imported this product from, uh, I think, uh, AutoDS or the DSERS app. So it is going to be, uh, these apps are going to be for drop shipping only. We're going to select this product and normally we are going to see that we have the product and also the variations. So from here, you're going to see that the product or the unit of this product price is going to be a specific for this specific area. And you're going to see in here the variants. So you can edit the variants in here product for each one of them. So you're going to name the variant and also add some reference for it. And then you're going to set up here different type of prices for each one of the variant. If you want to see that from uh, here at the beginning, you are going to create another product or add a product. I'm going to add it in here. Set up the title, the description, the media, and then the unit price for that product. For example, we are going to sell a product for $100. And we are going to add some variant to this product. So we are going basically here to add the variants in here. As you can see, we are going to see variants. We are going to add more options. And these options are going to be, for example, sizes. I'm going to put here, uh, for example, large size, medium size, and small size. We are going to click on done. And as you can see, we're going to see the variance and the product price is going to be shown. For example, the large, I'm going to set for 120. The medium is going to be 100 and the small is going to be much cheaper, which is going to be $80. When you finish that, you're going to click on save. And when you are going to head over or the client is going to be heading over the product, uh, let's say information or the product page, it is going to show them the variation that are available and the price is going to be changing depending on the used variant. Also, you can add here a, a different uh, variant option in here. So you can add, for example, a color, a expensive color, for example, black uh, or a specific or a special type of color. You can go ahead and put them and also put some uh, variant prices to them. So for example, here we are going to add some colors and these colors are going to be different. So I'm going to click on done here, done here. We are going to see all the, as you can see the colors. So I'm going to select the color and we are going to see all the uh, variants in here. So we can go ahead and cl click on the group and select the, for example, here, the color. For example, I'm going to put here 110. The white is going to be 130 and the yellow is going to be 80 or 90. Then we are going to set them up just like that and change the, as you can see, the variance in here. Basically, that was all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed the content and I hope to see you soon on the next one.